So now we've got our main page. Before we go any further with creating our layout, we're going to look at how we set up a booklet and how we send it to print because it does cause a little bit of confusion. So with a booklet, you need to make sure that you always have multiples of four because if you think about it, a book is made up of at least, or a booklet is made up of at least a front cover, a back cover, inside front cover, inside back cover. Everything is printed on the reverse and you need multiples of four, otherwise you're gonna end up with blank pages. So remember multiples of four if you're doing a magazine. So this would be just our inside front cover and our inside back cover, let's say front cover, back cover. So we'll pretend that that's all ready to go. We're happy with that. This is our bleed. This is what I was talking about earlier. So if we did have an image in here, we would take it right the way out to this red line so that when we trim it down, we've got a nice, clean edge to edge print. So that's that. So first thing we need to do, file, print booklet. So that's the first difference. We're not doing print, we're doing print booklet. And then just wait for the dialog box to come up. Here we go. If you see this big yellow triangle, our aim is to get rid of that. First thing we do, ignore everything here for now, print settings. Make sure we've got the right printer. Go to setup. Don't need to worry too much about your paper size here, but we'll just go through the motions. So we've got two A4, our pages are A4. So if you imagine two A4, we're going to A3. And that's a little bit condescending, but just to reiterate, we need to print it onto A3. We're going to do centered and we're going to scale to fit. Marks and bleeds, crop marks. So that's going to show you where you need to trim your booklet, magazine, etc. down, which is why the bleed marks on the document are really important. Set up, click OK there. Preferences, so this is a bit you'll be used to. A3, changes to landscape. Even though our pages are portraits, because we're printing on A3, it's going to become landscape. Usually we print on the thicker paper. So it's thick to bypass tray. And we've got some nice paper to do this on. Two sided, change to short edge and make sure you've got colour. So A3, landscape, thick to, bypass, short edge, color okay press print so now i'm hoping if we go to okay yeah so we've missed something because we've still got a yellow that's because we've got nothing on our paper so what i'm going to do is just cancel that Okay, so now I've got some ra rather badly placed images in my magazine. So now, if we go to print booklet, it saved all our settings. So if we go to the preview, we can see that we've got a magazine. Now it does look a bit, conf think you probably look at that and think, oh gosh, that's not right, but it is. So if we go back here, this is our front cover and this is the back cover the back of our brochure magazine whatever so now go to the second part this is the inside sorry this one is the inside front cover and this is the inside back cover so this gets printed on the reverse of your front and back page it does work promise you. So now you can go ahead and print that if you wanted to. But that's not what we're doing. That's just to show you how to set up your printing. 
we're always happy to help but please work through this video and have a go yourself because it's a lot easier than actually perhaps seems so please have a go and then if you struggle ask for some help